What is going on, you guys? My name is CPK, and today I am bringing you a um, somewhat different video to the things I normally do. So, basically, YouTube is hiding our videos. Now, that's probably a little dramatic and um, maybe even a tad clickbait. But recently, not just me, lots of other content creators have noticed that we're, we're getting a lot of tweets, we're getting a lot of DMs, messages from people saying that they're not receiving notifications when we when we upload anymore um or the videos aren't appearing in their sub boxes or anything like that and that's like that's concerning for me and for all all, all the other content creators as well i'm sure um so let me put you into like the scenario where i am and i'm going to explain everything so stay tuned because it's, it's a good one so I record a video and I render it out and I upload it and I usually have it unlisted so I can show a couple of friends to make sure it's fine or I have it as private. Now the process is that I then hit public. The video should then go to all of the sub boxes and when it hits all of the sub boxes it then puts a tweet out onto my Twitter with a message that I've custom created. So I'll say something like hey check out this video it's new. Blah, 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 blah. Now the other day, this is the first time I've really experienced this, but the other day I uploaded a video and it literally just never tweeted out. So I uploaded a uh, video called Useless Websites, which tends to, they tend to do okay on my channel. The videos tend to do pretty well. Um, and it tweeting out is a big indication to me that it's hit all the sub boxes and obviously it tweets out so people on Twitter see it. Um, and even to this day now, we're two days after this, still hasn't tweeted out the video. I had to tweet it myself. Um... So to, that video is somewhere lost in the hitting sub boxes process. So I don't know how many of my subscribers saw that video. And I tweeted out about it and saying that I was a bit annoyed. And I had three or four separate people tweet me saying that that video is not in their sub box. The video got, they got no notification for the video. And that's just the crazy thing. Like this system should work flawlessly. Like there shouldn't be issues in my in my head that's how i see it um especially obviously this is something that is my job it's a lot of my friends jobs so when something like this happens and we don't get people coming to the videos that then means that we're jeopardizing our job a little each time that happens so every time a video doesn't do well because people don't see it then that's one day worse off for us than if the video had been normal and hit all the sub boxes now, another thing that's been around for a really long time is the highlights versus um, everything option, which a lot of you probably won't know about. So I'm going to I'm gonna shrink down my face cam and show you exactly what I mean by this. Okay, so I'm just going to leave myself like this. Um, usually I would crop it, but it's not really necessary right now. So if I go to my, let's, let's go to my subscriptions for now um, and see who is there. So if I were for to instance go to Razbowski's channel, now, I'm sub to him. So what you'll see is over here, there's the subscribed button, and then there's this little bell. Now, the little bell, if you click on that, I actually get to choose whether I get zero notifications, highlights, or all of his videos. Now, I like Razbowski. I enjoy watching his videos. I want to see them all. But it was default set to highlights, which only shows me a smaller selection of the videos. So it says I'm notified by push and email when they upload. You can manage that here and change what you want. So I've changed that to all now. So now the little bell has a little like alarm sound around it, like it's ringing. Um, so my advice is to go to every YouTuber you enjoy watching daily, like anyone who does daily content, like me, Yami, Oli, you know, Joel. Oli doesn't do daily content. Um, you know, anyone that you enjoy watching the content of and you don't want to miss a video of, then I suggest going and hitting this everything button because yes, it might not help a huge amount, but it's going to mean you're going to get the notifications. You're definitely going to see the video when it comes out. And it means you're not missing out on older videos. Like I know myself, my audience is really young. I know personally, my audience is really young. My audience is probably between seven years old, maybe even younger than that, and like 15. And then there's a few anomalies who are over that and stuff like that. And um, basically, that means that because they have school or they have, you know, anything like that, some people have jobs it means they can't watch videos on the day they're released. My videos usually take about one week before they hit full like view stoppage. That's where it'll stop after about a week. Um, the highlights option actually only shows you the previous two videos on that channel. So like 
not yesterday, the day before that, I uploaded two videos. So if you checked your sub box, you'd only see those two and nothing else I uploaded earlier, which means that you'd have to go through the effort of checking my channel and doing all that kind of stuff, which is just ridiculous. Um, I don't know how much of this is, you know, actually going on. I know a lot of people say that they're not getting people to the channel or people aren't watching the videos and it's hard to define what's you know just a september slump because everyone back everyone went back to school so that always takes a hit there um or whether you know people actually aren't having i mean i know a lot of my friends um yami is one who talks about this a lot um and it's really interesting to look at because people get unsubscribed so i haven't had this much i only had this once recently someone said they got unsubbed from me um, so everyone's currently theory crafting around why people would be unsubbed. Um, I saw Yami say that it was something like if they don't watch your videos for a certain amount of time, YouTube deems it like an inactive account. So it unsubs them from you, which is ridiculous because there are certain YouTubers that I watch. Like, I mean, for example, KSI, I don't really watch him for about two weeks at a time. And then I go and binge watch like two weeks of his videos because that's just the way that I prefer to do it. Same with PewDiePie. Um, I you know, I binge watch a lot of his videos rather than just watching one. Um, so for them to potentially unsubscribe me from that channel is is crazy. Um, I don't know what the whole thing is behind it, and I really don't know how we can fix it. My only, you know, thoughts are is that everyone gets behind their favorite channels. You know, tell your friends about your favorite channels. Share your favorite videos on Twitter. Like the videos. Comment on the videos. Make the content creator feel better about their content because everyone's going through a really hard time right now and no one really knows why a lot of creators have taken a huge hit and nobody really knows what's going on so if you guys can get behind the content creators we can continue to keep doing what we love we can keep making videos we can keep making you guys happy we can do everything right um, and hopefully all this all these problems come to light and are solved soon because it's getting a bit of a nightmare um, so as I said, go and hit the uh, the all button instead of highlights because that'll probably help you see my videos and do that for every channel that you really love. Um, I guess that's it from me. There's not really much else I can say. I just thought I'd have this little vent, rant, whatever you want to call it. A lot of people asked me to do it on Twitter. Um, so hopefully you enjoyed this video. Uh, and yeah, keep supporting content creators, guys. I'll see you guys next time. Peace.